Hey guys, it's Jojo from Jojo's Cup of Mocha. Welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, please hit the subscribe button and the bell for notifications. Um, so today, <clears throat> excuse my voice, my allergies. Today, I'm going back home to Staten Island to visit my friend Crystal. I'm super duper excited. I can't wait. It is now 7.25. It's very early in the morning, but it's like a two and a half hour drive back. So I figure the earlier the better. So Staten Island, right? Why are you going to Staten Island? Well, Staten Island is kind of the forgotten borough of New York City. Not in the sense that people physically forget it's there, but it's just not as popular as like Manhattan or Brooklyn or the Bronx. Um, people mostly know Staten Island for the Staten Island Ferry where you can take a free ride to and from Staten Island, but they just look at the Statue of Liberty, um, Ellis Island, I think that's about it. <laughs> they really don't know what else is on Staten Island, what there is there is to do, basically, on Staten Island. So they pretty much just ride the ferry and then go back to Manhattan. But I wanted to take you guys along with me as well so you can see, like, there are things to do on Staten Island if you have the chance, if you have a little bit of money because... It's not as expensive as Manhattan, but if you're like near the ferry or in certain parts, it can't be a bit more expensive. But I just wanted to show you guys what there is to do on Staten Island. So yeah, I hope you enjoy it. But before we start, I have to go and get my coffee because, girl, it is very, very early in the morning and I need my coffee. So see ya. here on Staten Island. I'm here just waiting to pick up my friend. I haven't texted her yet, but I just wanted to let you guys know that I arrived safely. Yes, so I'm going to text her so we can meet up and see what we want to do. I'm hoping we get food because I'm really hungry. <laughs> like, hey Crystal, uh, can we go get like food please and thank you because I haven't eaten since like six o'clock this morning. It's like mm, about 10 o'clock now, so. We shall see. Obviously, if I'm wearing it 24-7. Exactly. There's like nobody. Nobody whatsoever. Hi, Crystal. Hi. <laughs> <laughs> Just walking around. I don't know. Not much to do. <laughs> You're like, wait, I forgot what it's called already. Know you know? What the World Trade Center was. Yeah, you know like that building up there where the World Trade Centers used to be? Yeah. That's the Freedom Tower and that's the little Staten Island Ferry off to the distance. Look at that EO for Empire Outlets. Woohoo!
but this is the Empire Outlets uh, near the ferry. How else would you describe them, Crystal? You actually live here <laughs> now. It's just a so. shopping center, pretty much. Yes, yeah, a shopping it's a nice center. Nice view of yeah, I mean, it opened up a few years ago, I would say, maybe. I think a year ago. Or a year ago, yeah. It was delayed a lot. <laughs> what else is new? New York City, right? Yeah, there's not a whole lot of people here. Not all the stores are open. Yeah, not all of them are open and whatnot, but it's still fun to look around and whatnot. If you're ever on Staten Island, this is right next to the ferry, so this is like one of the things that you can actually come and do. When stores are actually open. Yeah. <laughs> Great, that's it. Yes, Empire Outlets, NYC. I think currently the only food places that are really open are like um, Starbucks, the ice cream place, and Shake Shack. Ooh, Shake Shack, yeah, it's so good. It's right over there. I don't know if Bay Culture is open. Uh, well, why are you closed? I mean, closed to the public. public. Pardon our appearance during construction. Coming soon. Well, I guess. <laughs> I think I also forgot to say as well, this part of Staten Island is St. George. So, um, the city is like right across the harbor and then when you come here on the Staten Island Ferry, you're in the St. George area. Um, there are other parts of Staten Island, obviously, but besides the Empire Outlets, um, what else would you say there is to do in this area? There's, I think there's like the St. George Theater, which we can check out one of these yeah. days. Um, like the courthouse. Oh god, there's a huge um, bug. Sorry. <laughs> Snug Harbor, um, which isn't that yeah. far away. Snug Harbor, um, Staten Island Museums and things like that, yeah. Oh yeah, there's a museum near here. <laughs> yeah, there are quite a few. And it's like a couple blocks away. Yeah. From here. There you go. <laughs> it's been a while since I've been here, so I have to like kind of refresh my memory back in the day, you know. I haven't been travel. to that museum since elementary school, so. Yeah. This is crazy. It's like nobody here. Um, oh, you hear that? That means the ferry. It's either docking out or it's coming in. One of those two. It's 10.32. It's 10.32. Ooh, that's okay. I look how nice I'm with you over there and like over here. Like, I know. We are just trying to figure out how to best describe Staten Island because like I was telling you earlier, it's the forgotten borough of New York City. Like, New Yorkers know that Staten Island is a thing, it's here, but yeah. it's not really popular, nobody really knows what to do once they're on the island, besides the mall or whatnot, but I would say Staten Island's very suburban and residential, mostly, it's yeah. not like urban, it's not like Manhattan or anything like that. There are quieter parts, but there are also kind of like busier parts, like here on Forest Avenue. Yeah, the more south you go, the more mm -hmm. um, quieter it gets. And bougie it gets. Yeah. <laughs> you Unless you get to the south south. Like, that's true, that's true. But right all along the beach, like you can find beautiful, like big expensive houses. Yeah. Where we live on the northern part of Staten Island. Not so much. Not, yeah. <laughs> not so much. It's more urban. <laughs> it's more urban than like the middle is kinda like more residential and as you get farther south it's like more suburban, you know. Yeah. But that's okay. I, I prefer being in the northern part of Staten Island because I like that diversity, that urban setting. I, I'm from Brooklyn originally. I'm not used to suburban living. Yeah. Especially out in PA. It's like rural. Like, you go like two minutes down the road, there are like farms and rolling hills. Like, I'm not used to that. I like the urban setting. But the south, the southern part of Staten Island is pretty good too. I don't know. It's That's easier to get around from the north, if anything. Yeah, because there aren't a whole lot of buses or anything like that. If they do, they come every so often. Like, remember we used to work in Tottenville? Tottenville? Like, if this is Staten Island, you guys, Tottenville is like all the way down we in like the, at the south part, part of Staten Island. And the train, we had to catch it home. It ran like, what, every two hours or something like that? It was horrible. Yes, we were getting out late, that's why. Very, very late. 
to the northern part of Staten Island. Yeah. That's not, not fun. fun. <laughs> it wasn't fun. But there was that nice little um, food market right next to it. That's which true. Really good. Yeah, they're cute little quaint places yeah. and whatnot, but if you're looking for more activities and things to do, I would stick it's to like the middle and northern part. Mid north, parts. mostly. Because even yeah. in the middle, there's not that much. Unless you're yeah. talking about just where you mentioned the beaches. Yeah. I think that's the best that I can do to, s to describe Staten Island because everyone knows Manhattan. It's not like Manhattan. Yeah. You know, it's, it's interesting. Everybody knows Manhattan and Brooklyn. Manhattan and Brooklyn, I gotta represent. I'm biased. Sorry. I'm from Brooklyn originally. I've only ever lived here. Yeah. Well, Nicki Minaj is from Queens. Cardi yeah. B is from the Bronx. Um, you know, those are the more yeah. famous boroughs. Oh, if you didn't know, New York City is not just Manhattan. It's the five boroughs. So Manhattan, Brooklyn, Queens, the Bronx, and Staten Island. We're on the forgotten borough of New York City. Pretty much. Pretty much. Nobody knows. Nobody really cares. But I wanted to do these walks so that way I could show you like there are things to do here. It can be really fun um, if you ever have the chance or opportunity to just go around Staten Island. It's not going to be like Manhattan or Brooklyn or any of the other boroughs, but you know, it's something. It's better yeah. than nothing. You know, I got to represent because I did live here for like four years before I went away to college. You know, I and mean, you're my best friend. We've been yeah. best friends for like almost a decade now. So eight I years, I think. Yeah, you rounded out to two. Yeah. It's like a decade. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah, pretty much. <laughs> Math. Yeah. yeah, you just kind of round up, you know. It's bigger than five, so you just round up. Yeah. So I just want to show some love for Staten Island. You know, you're not forgotten. Yeah. Yeah. Not completely. Yeah. So. We are going to a very cool place, but I will save that for another video. See you guys! Bye.